Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to go over a new Doodly update, version 2.9.8. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. Hi, everyone. You may have noticed the last time you opened Doodly that there's a new update available. Today we're going to talk about it real quick. We've got version 2.9.8 and there's two new features that we want to talk about. The first one is the ability to set the first scene as a thumbnail of the exported video. And the other one is the ability to split a subtitle into several parts using the break tag in, within a scene. Then of course there's a couple of improvements and fixes. So let's start with the ability to set the first scene as a thumbnail. So normally when you export your video and you look at the thumbnail on your computer, either in Windows File Explorer or Mac Finder, your first scene doesn't show up as your thumb thumbnail. Maybe it's just this first frame, the blank white, or you know, maybe it's just some random scene in the middle of the video. And you're like, I don't know what that's about. Well, now Doodly takes your very first scene. So right here, my very first one, let me go ahead and hide that is this scene. And when I export it, this will show up as my thumbnail. So I'm going to go ahead and export it real quick. Doodly's going to do its thing. I didn't have to do anything special. This just kind of automatically happens. Okay, so now let's click show exported file. And what we're going to expect to see is the thumbnail that says first scene is thumbnail. And here it is right here on my desktop and you can see it says first scene is thumbnail and it's that scene. So there's no hand, there's no blank white, it is my scene. And really that's all there is to that. Okay, next let's talk about split subtitles. So I have this scene here and this is the text that I'm going to have playing fetch with your dog is great exercise and a lot of fun. Now normally when you enter your subtitle it's going to be your whole sentence. Okay, so let's just take a look here at my scene. Playing fetch with your dog is a lot of fun and great exercise, right? That's fine. And let's just move that. Let's go ahead and preview it. Playing fetch with your dog is a lot of fun and great exercise. Well, what if I want to split this up like I had in my little um, shot here? Playing fetch with your dog is great exercise and a lot of fun. Well, I certainly can do that. Now I go to back to scene settings. I go to my subtitle and now all I need to do is add the break code. And what that is, is this little um, bracket here, BR and then the closing bracket. Just like that. Okay and you just place this break wherever you want it to split. So I'm going to do one more. I'm going to split it so we have three separate subtitles on one scene. So let's take a look. Playing fetch with your dog is a lot of fun and great exercise. And then finally there's some minor improvements and fixes. Let's take a look at this improvement. The update shows the created and modified time in the video list of the home screen. So what does that mean? Well, your home screen, so go back to my videos. Here's our home screen. So now we have created on and modified on. So I created this at 1159 today and I modified it at 1229 today. And then what about this little arrow here on modified on? Well, you can sort your videos based on the modification date. So right now it's sorting based on um, the most recent one, which is today, March 1st. And then it goes like that. Well, what if I want to do it the other way? So back in 2021, I had some that I worked on. Okay. So you can sort them either way. So that's just new. And then of course there's a few little minor bug fixes. In any case, enjoy the new features and thanks for watching.